wishing all of you a wonderful, wonderful new year. I mean, this year will be the most auspicious, filled with Guruji's grace and blessings in your lives, your families, your friends, and the entire world. I'm quite a one track. <laughs> Even in the greeting Happy New Year, I find a such clue. <laughs> so if the year is new, who is it new for? A new year is here now. And a new year was here last year also. And a new year was here the year before that also. And before that also. And before that also. Before it was not. There comes a point that there is no experience of a new year. So the one who's had these new year experiences over the years is which one? <laughs> so if time is, if a year is a measure of time and time seems to present these new possibilities for us at regular intervals, then you who are tasting this flow of time, are you subject to this time? If it is the year that rejuvenates and there is a new year that comes for you, a new day which comes for you, a new minute which comes for you, a new second which comes for you, is the you for whom it comes subject to it? And on the other hand, if you were not here, would there be this next minute, next moment, new year, only in imagination. Even for imagination, you have to be there. So you are the actually the substratum. So this is another one of the mind's convictions, which will say that you are the one that is subject to time. Actually, you are the subject of time. Time is the object for you. So this wonderful new year appearance is appearing for all of you and I hope you have the most joyful, blissful time in this new year and of course as with every year it will be mixed with some sugar and spice. <laughs> so don't expect it to be only a certain way, know that all the, in this world of duality all the ups and downs will come. But more and more you are starting to see that you are not oppressed by time. You are not controlled by time. Even for time to exist, you must be. If there was no such thing as time, then for one thing we would not have to or get to wish each other happy new year. Is it? But also you would experience yourself in your entirety in just this moment. A dynamic aspect also is being stretched out seemingly over that which we call time. But actually nothing is moving. It is all already here. We're just visiting it with our attention. The movement of this attention leads to what we call this time and space. What is the screen on which all of this is? You might feel like it is outside you because you might believe that you are this body 
and the world where all this is happening is outside of you. But actually you are just experiencing all of this on the screen of your own being. That is why whether you call it internal perceptions or outer perceptions, there's only one space in which you are perceiving them. <laughs> 